So here's the big news, I would say, for our show, anyway. Uh U.S. News and World Report has released their 2024 rankings of the best state and the worst states. Oh, interesting. Okay. And guess who's number one? Well, if it's big news for us, I would hope it's Idaho. Utah. Ah. Oh, missed it by that much. Which I think we're better because we have better liquor laws, just saying. (laughs) (laughs) It's true. Among other things. Not wrong. (laughs) Yeah. They've got medical marijuana, though. Oh, that's true. See, Carly, that's south. I'm pointing south toward Utah right now. (laughs) Um, I would have thought that was south. (laughs) So, okay. Uh, They evaluated eight categories, healthcare, education, economy, infrastructure, opportunity, fiscal stability, crime and corrections, and natural environment. Okay. More than 70 metrics and tens of thousands of data points were considered. Wow. Employment, internet access, affordability, public safety. Now, okay, why would we even bring this up then if we didn't win? I mean, I have to assume we're pretty close to the top because we're pretty close to what Utah's about. Yeah, we're fifth. That's pretty good. So it goes Utah, number one, New Hampshire, Nebraska, Minnesota, and Idaho. I mean, that's like, what, 10th percentile? Yeah. Right? That's, I think that's pretty good. Top five out of 50? Yeah. So suck it, Iowa. Yeah. Number six. Yeah. Even if we do get mistaken for you a lot, Iowa. <laughs> <laughs> hey, way to go, Utah. I think they're wrong. I, do I think too. I think Idaho's better. We might be a little biased, though. Here's the thing. I think that they are probably statistically better, but I think culturally, Idaho's better. Mm-hmm. I think we're a little cooler, a little more laid back, a little less of douchebags up here. Now, you might be asking. <laughs> Sorry. And we're way better drivers. Mike and Carly from IFAF, give me three reasons why Idaho is better than Utah. Here they come. Number one, Cheech and Chong is at it again with their cruise choose ads. Oh, no. Are they crapping on us again? This time we'll put it up here. We we deserve it. It's fine. (laughs) Well, we're the only state they can't ship to because of our weird weed laws. Yeah. But they use the distracted boyfriend meme. Mm -hmm. You know, the one. He's walking with one girl, but looking back at another. Yeah. Yeah. And she's noticing him doing that. Very upset. Mm -hmm. Which, by the way, there are other examples throughout history. One famously including Charlie Chaplin. Oh, like the shiny Pokemon of that meme. Where that, yeah, where where that happens. (laughs) So in this example, the boy is the United States. The Uh girl he's checking out is Cheech and Chong's cruise choose. Right. And the girl looking at him in disgust is Idaho. I mean, (laughs) I guess we're just going to have to bear with it. It's fine. Until it's for now legalized you on know, a federal level. I'm just gonna say they thought that gay marriage would never happen, and now it's Pride Month. So look, we both grew up in Idaho. We're used to people making fun of us. Do your damnedest, Cheech and mm-hmm. Chong. Yeah. All right. So that's reason number one why Idaho is better. Reason number two, <laughs> Idaho is better. There's a guy named Lucky who decided to sell his house and live in a Tesla Cyber Truck the other night. Okay. I was driving down hit and I ran it. I didn't run into him. I saw his Tesla cyber truck driving down the road. Okay. Yeah. He's just getting started. I think he started out in Texas. Oh. Been to New Mexico and Colorado. Okay. He's currently in Yellowstone National Park. Good for him. So links to his YouTube channel and uh, his Instagram is in are in this post. He's mm-hmm. at Lucky Go Round on YouTube. Mm-hmm. But what a cool concept, right? In its own way. Mm-hmm. I mean, I think the Cybertrucks are so ugly. Well, and, uh, <laughs> like they're just not a good looking car. And there's the whole finger crushing thing. There have been a couple of different recalls on those. Well, and Cybertrucks don't do. Elon Musk actually stated that Cybertrucks would be able to ford small bodies of water. Yeah. And check this out. Here's a Cybertruck doing exactly not that. Yeah, no, no way. They cyber trucks can't do what trucks do. Of course not. So the third and final reason why Idaho is better than Utah. And we'll leave you with this. I don't know if you've ever seen this. I found it in my internet travels. There is an old motel in Coeur d'Alene, Idaho. Anyway, it used to be called the State Motel, and it has a chimney in the shape of Idaho. Which is so cool, honestly. If you're looking for a destination this summer mm-hmm. and Coeur d'Alene's on your list go check out maybe even stay there it's now called the North Idaho Inn oh that's cute yeah I'd like to see them make a chimney out of the shape of Utah yeah 
look real dumb. Isn't aren't all chimneys the shape of Utah? No, they're too long. Just sort of stretched out. <laughs> you, you can't stretch <laughs> it or else it doesn't it work. <laughs> <laughs> if you're one of those vacationing families that loves to hop into Winnebago and go see the biggest ball of twine in Minnesota, Aww. be sure to stop by the North Idaho Inn in Coeur d'Alene. Check out their Idaho chimney. Uh-huh. 